Why, Joe, shouldn't Cue Card win the Gold Cup? Why shouldn't he? Yeah, why shouldn't he win? Why shouldn't he win? What is, what is not in his favour, if anything? Well, that's Matt. There's nothing not in his favour. Um, the stats... No, 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 it's fine. It's fine, we got it. But there are people who believe this horse cannot win the race. Why can he win the race for you? There is no reason why he cannot win this race. Um, if he showed any bit of being an 11 year old at home, we would, we would be wary of him, but he doesn't. Um, he's, been going to the, he's, he's, he's been going to the festival for seven years now. There are excuses for, um, excuses for his King George run this year. He came back at lymphangitis in his hock. He also coughed for four days afterwards, um, which some of our horses have all through January. This will crack actually did that after the Cotswold Chase, but that's by the by. Um, he's in great nick. He did what he should have done at Ascot last time. Um, it was odds on he had to do it, but question his form. There is no question his form. He's, like, he's been a brilliant, brilliant horse for us, but he is 11 years old. And I think Thistlecrack would have beaten him, but he's not there. He's not there this year, and I think he would have won last year, but he didn't complete the competition. Right, here's the, here's, the, here's the obvious question. It is the most obvious question. It's, it's a difficult question for Joe to answer, but it's one that I, I, keep, I will keep plugging away until the answer comes. It's quite straightforward. If you, if you were the stable jockey still, and you had the choice between Q Card or Native River right now, today, which one would you ride in the Shalom Gold Cup? I've, um, I've listen, dodged, listen. I have dodged this for for for, uh, for the last month, probably. Yeah. Oh, never, certainly, including Thistlecrack. Um, I thought I I never said it, but I, I I generally thought Thistlecrack would have won it. Um, but I also watched every horse in our yard work this morning. And, I, and I'd ride a cue card. And, and, and that takes nothing away from Native River. Um, shush, 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 hang on. Hang on a minute. Hang on, hang on. Can I just say, can I just say before we carry on? Before we carry on, uh, listen, listen up, listen up here. I've, I've spent the whole week asking this man this question. And it's a bloody difficult question for him to answer. He's got owners to keep happy, and he's answered it tonight. So give him a big round of applause for having the balls to stick his neck on the line. Yeah, well, come back, come back for a second. Um, I watched, that's, that's nothing against Native River at No, all. we know that. Um, he worked brilliantly this morning as well, but I just think that he has to take another step up. He, he is improving all the time, don't get me wrong, but Cucard has been there, he's done it, he's beaten the best, and he looks fucking fantastic at the moment. Right, right, hang on, shush! If you behave for about five minutes, you'll get a Q and A. Rich Richie, Rich Richie, first of all, first of all, that is a significant, a significant moment. But you've got a horse in this race that's been second the last two years, Jack Adam. The fellow did it when he was a similar age. He went second, second, fourth, first. Could your horse win it, having been second twice in the race already? Well, the, the first I would, thing I would say is, is that I agree with uh, Joe. I think Hugh Card would have finished second or won last year, one of the two. Um, Jack Adam didn't have the right prep. Q card was coming with a run. Unfortunately, he fell. Great horse. The second thing it is, you know, you asked me earlier about why do we invest in this game. It's people like Joe and the audience response to a horse like Q card. You can tell he loves the horse. Now, he's not sentimental about it, and he said he'd ride the horse on merit. 
But isn't that wonderful? Seven years of the festival. Come on. What other game do you get that in? So well done, Jeff. And it would be wonderful for the sport if he won. That being said, I fancy the Jesus out of Jack and Dan. I, I think, I think, I think he's the right age. It was funny, I was, at a, I was at a dinner in the turf club in 2015, and we were going around the usual thing that you're doing, and you asked somebody, and I said, they said, well, Jack and I win the gold cup. I said, no, he'll win the gold cup in 2017. And I'm hoping this is our year. We were beaten by an exceptional horse in Coney Gree. We were beaten by an exceptional horse in Don Cossack. Willie's never won the Gold Cup. We would love to win the Gold Cup. Susanna would like to win the Gold Cup because she said, if we win the Gold Cup, can we stop spending all this money? <laughs> Too bad. But, but the, 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 the issue, is, the issue is, is, I think he's got a great chance this year. It's a very good race, but I'm Jack Adam. I, I think this is his chance. If he doesn't do it this year, We'll be in the Grand National next year. So let's hope he does it now. Paul Keeley. Paul Keeley, we've had... It's like being at the Circus Tavern. I'm yelling, wanker, wanker. Anyway, go on, go on, go on, go on. Come on, then. All right, yeah. Well, apparently, rumour has it when Thistlecracker, rumour had it when Thistlecrack came out. Matt asked all of his mates if he could change it to a circumcision. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, if there's not even, if there's not even a small part of you that doesn't want Q card to win the Gold Cup, yeah. something wrong with you. Yeah. All right. Small part of Matt. I He's. He's, Quit a, for racing. he's an absolutely wonderful horse. He's been around, he's had his problems, he's come back. I had him as, I had him have my password on all sorts of accounts for years. Right? <laughs> and then yeah, we don't want to know about that. And then and then the uh, the year he lost his form, I changed it all to about another three, four horses. Uh, you know, and I, I didn't think he'd come back. And then he came back last year, he was brilliant. This year's been up and down. I'm wondering. One thing, whether he's now a proper soft ground horse. Don't know whether that's right because he wasn't a soft ground horse earlier in his life, and I hope he's not. But then you've got the, the other point again is history. Corto Star, Denman could not win the race at the age of 10. The last winner over the age of 10 was 1969. I'd love to see, I'd dearly love to see him win, but. There's no prisoners taken in a Gold Cup, especially in the big field. And, you know, I struggle. I, listen, I've had, a, I've had a decent bet on Jack Adam. If they go to the last together, I'll shout on, I'll shout on cue card. I will, because I love him. Native River. It's good, this. Na Na Native, Native River is a really, really tough horse. Right? And I didn't get where the owners were coming from the other day saying there are knockers of him. Thank you. But mm -hmm. now I'm going to knock him. What did right. they say? What did they say? They, 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 said they, they said there was loads of knockers of the horse. I know this. Which there are. No, 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 no one's knocked no. the horse. Laughing Anne had never left Wellington. And, and <laughs> shh, shh. No, they, 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 this is a press thing. Go Poor on. old Gene Bishop is going to... We've just had to stop it coming out that Cucar might retire if, in the gold, after the Gold Cup, whatever. And, right. and it's annoyed Dad and I, to be honest, because they put words in your mouth. Yeah, yeah. Right, so they put it straight into poor right. old Garth and Anne. You okay, know, so they live in Wellington. Right, yeah, yeah. so, yeah. Yeah, they didn't, come up, they didn't come across great in the media. That's right, there are a lot of people that have not come off great in the media and they've been done a disservice too, as well. So, yeah, that, that, that's fair enough. But anyway, anyway, Native River... Native Rivers won two handicaps. It was probably not a great Hennessy, but that doesn't matter because he pissed up in the Welsh National. Right. Same weight, same, same handicap mark. Then he came and won that race at Newby where Bristol De Mai didn't run the form. The second horse, there's no way it would be a thousand for the Gold Cup. That form's not great. Right. If the race was on a flat track, I'd give him a massive chance. But I'll take you back to last year's four miler 
when he was the best horse in the race by a mile yeah, and true. didn't win. There were some very, very average horses that ran past him coming down the hill. And it's not because he wasn't giving, because he's a most generous horse. When they start asking him, he really picks up. It was because he couldn't handle the track. No, no, that's it's wrong. It's because he couldn't handle that's, the track. That's wrong. Give me, can I have some time? Um, yeah, get, get Joe's mic up. No, that, that's actually wrong. Um, if you look back at the National Hunt Chase last year, he was, um, he was the, the donkey. There was two that went clear, and he, he was doing his own work. He was also a six-year-old at the time, um, and he grew unbelievably during the summer. He's come back in this year. He has to step up again. I, I totally agree with that. Um, his Skull Cup was, uh, was uh, Hennessy, but um, he's still behind Q card on official ratings and what he's done. But like, don't question his run last year. He, he had to step up. Q card, Q card is, uh, is Joe's pick. Um, uh, I back Jack and Amber. Jack and Amber, Paul. I think Jack, I, I think Jack and Amber will go really, really close. I wouldn't rule out sizing John. I think he'll be a big drifter on the day because people think he won't stay and whatever. But he's got the perfect profile a few shush, years shush. ago. He'd have the perfect profile a few years ago of a Gold Cup winner. Second season chaser, handful of runs over fences, just won a grade one at three miles, saved his best for Cheltenham for the last two years. Got a big, got a big run in him. And it obviously, as you heard, it's Jack and Dan for Richard. Rich